I'm going to teach you guys how to make the perfect Brussels sprout. If you're new to my channel, welcome to my channel. My name is Tiffany Suzette. I have five cloves of garlic chopped and already ready to go. I have some oil in my pan on medium heat. Just enough oil to cover the bottom. And we're going to saute up some Brussels sprouts. So yummy. So these are the Brussels sprouts going to be using. I got this bag from Giant. This is a two pound bag. I'm not going to use all of these, you guys. I'm using, uh, probably going to use like half of the bag. Even though these are hubby favorites. He loves Brussels sprouts. But we're going to only do about half. Maybe a little over. And the rest we're going to put in a zip locky. A zip locky. Big. I, um, have one, I, I, rem, I was thinking about one of my old school movies I used to watch. It's called Congo. And the man and the, the actor in there, he was telling somebody he was eating cake, right? Some sesame cake. And he was like, stop eating my sesame cake. That always stuck with me for some reason. I've seen the movie like a billion times and I'm just gonna seal this up and I'm gonna label it here and put these bad boys in the freezer all right so I'm gonna rinse my Brussels sprouts And if you have never prepared Brussels sprouts, I'm going to show you how to cut them up. Sometimes you can even uh, boil them before you actually prepare them. I think it's an extra step you don't necessarily have to take. I'm going to check on our oil. Our oil is ready, y'all. I'm going to take y'all with me. So I'm about to I have five cloves of garlic here that I'm just going to chop up. Um, that I'm going to add in my Brussels sprouts and I'm going to show y'all how to trim them and how to slice them down before preparing them, okay? So, Y'all hear hubby in the background watching CNN. That's his favorite show. He loves watching the news, so. I think fresh garlic is so much better than the stuff that they put in the uh, the jar that people use because they don't want to don't feel like chopping the garlic up. It's like a, it's, I guess it's easier for people to do that. Just scoop it out of a jar. <laughs> but everything has got to realize that whatever is in that jar that's preserving the garlic. Um, you know, it's not fresh. So, just to keep that in mind. And it also has like an aftertaste too. So, our garlic is chopped. Let me get that away. So, what you want to do, it's already been rinsed and clean. You want to chop off so y'all just the end piece. Put it to the side. And some leaves will come off like that. And then I just Slice them in half. That easy. That easy peasy. Now 
Just put them back in here. And then I'm going to do this. I'm going to do the rest of the Brussels sprouts. And I'll get back to back to show y'all what the ribs look like so far. So, honey faces, this is our Brussels sprouts. Look at that. See that car right there? That's what we want. That's what we're looking for. I'm trying to hold the tripod and stir this at the same time. So now, I'm going to add our garlic. garlic in there. Infuse that nice garlic flavor. It's going to take the flavor up a notch, I promise you. And you can also eat Brussels sprouts by itself if you like them. Try this recipe. I promise you will. Some people don't know how to prepare them. And sometimes people say they're a little sour. But if you saute them, that fresh garlic will take away that taste. It smells so good in here. And we're going to let this go. I'm also going to cover it so they can get soft. Stay tuned. So our Brussels sprouts are almost done. I had some leftover bacon from breakfast. And that's what we're gonna do. Just guess. Yeah. Y'all already know me. Leave not, waste not, want not. And you know, bacon goes great with everything. Mm. Watch closely. Go now. Yep. We just did that. Yes, we did. And that's it. That's how you saute up some beautiful Brussels sprouts in like 10 minutes. You guys, thanks for watching my channel. Please try this recipe. It's a must. It's a absolutely must. Don't thank me later. Just enjoy. You guys stay blessed and less stressed. And with that being said, bye.